Welcome to the show. We are celebrating International Women's Day on the show today, talking about some fantastic women here in our community and some amazing organizations. We start off the show with some music because one of the most talented and hardworking singer-songwriters in the city joining us on the show today, her name is Danielle Allard. And before we catch up with her, here's a little taste of what you can expect when she performs live at Live on Elgin. We'll tell you when you can catch her. Here is Invader by Danielle Allard. is Invader by Danielle Allard. She joins us on the show live here today on International Women's Day. Happy International Women's Day to you, Danielle. Thanks so much for celebrating with us. Um, I'm just looking at the space that you're in and, you know, when uh, for those people that don't understand, you know, some of the technology that you're using in that song, may maybe you can describe it for us. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so much for having me, Derek. And I've missed your face. I <laughs> generally miss people. So it's really such a pleasure to be back. But it's been a huge period of, of growth for me in terms of learning new gear, trying to be my own broadcaster, camera person, audio engineer. So a lot of what you're hearing, well, I mean, all of what you're hearing has been live loop through a pedal that I have here on the ground. So you're hearing the bongos and you're hearing the synthesizer and the guitar, and we've got some uh, hand pan as well in that mix and all the harmonies are done live while I'm streaming here. And this is just my basement. So uh, welcome on in everyone. I love it. Well, and you've been doing a lot of things virtually as well. You, you, you're on Twitch, you're on uh, Discord, some of these things. You know, I'm over 50 now, Danielle. I have no idea what a Discord community is. So <laughs> let's start with that, first of all. I mean, you are doing it still three times a week on, on Twitch, but um, tell me a little bit about your Discord community. 
Uh, absolutely. So streaming music live sometimes for three to four hours a day, Sundays, Mondays and Thursdays. So it's been a lot of practice that I've been getting every single week. But uh, so many people wanted to spend time together outside of that. So we have an entire community built on Discord for when we can talk to each other outside of stream time. And we're running weekly games and movies. We have a Skillshare group. And I mean, there's tons of Ottawa based artists and musicians that are part of that as well well and people just from around the world and just really incredible wonderful funny people that have chosen to spend so much time with me but that's just kind of this offline space and when you try to think about that as um, kind of a virtual uh, fan space you'd be seeing each other before and after shows right you'd have the chance to talk to other people who were fans of the same musicians as you were and with that not happening discord has kind of come become that before and after show space where people who like the same things can just uh, be together in that environment and you'd mentioned patreon as well as a very scary word but that just means that you can be somebody who is uh, supporting an artist long term to be able to make new projects. So uh, starting the Discord community, starting the Patreon community, and I just spent a whole week living in a studio and streaming that whole experience on Patreon. So you don't have to be scared of those words anymore, Derek. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Well, and I meant it. You're one of the hardest working artists I have ever met in my life. And you, you've continued that even uh, throughout <laughs> the pandemic. It's been over two years since you performed live. So you're going to be back at live on Elgin. Just as I'm running out of time here, March 19th, you must be excited to be back performing live in front of an audience. Oh, I can't wait. And that space is like my home away from home. I just love the staff. I love the environment. And I knew that my first indoor show that it had to be at Live on Elgin. So I'm so excited that that's happening March 19th. Yeah, and it's such an intimate space, actually. We had Lawrence on the show last week just to talk about who was upcoming. Of course, he mentioned wonderful. your upcoming show and some other wonderful local artists. Danielle, <laughs> um, you said it to me. I'll say it to you. So wonderful to see you again after all of these years. Thanks so much for joining us. And, you know, enjoy that moment. I know it's going to be magical for you to get back on stage. And I remind you, viewers at home, live on Elgin on March the 19th, and you can visit Danielle's website to find out where she's going to be performing next.